हेलो एवरीवन दिस इज़ फातिमा सिम्फा वाला अकोला वाला फ्रॉम आईएसडीटी कॉलेज नासिक टुडे आई विल टीच यू अ प्रैक्टिकल सेशन ऑन हाउ टू यू डू यू डू योर ऑब्जेक्टिव रिफ्रैक्शन नाउ व्हाट डू यू मीन बाय ऑब्जेक्टिव रिफ्रैक्शन इज दैट व्हेन यू योर एज एन एग्जामिनर हाउ आर यू चेकिंग द नंबर ऑफ द कस्टमर ओके सो देर आर टू टेक्निक्स यू कैन डू योर ऑब्जेक्टिव रिफ्रैक्शन इधर बाय रेटिनोस्कोपी और बाई योर ऑटो रिफ्रैक्टोमीटर so here i am doing the retinoscopy you can also do it with the auto refractometer at your optical shop okay now for retinoscopy what are the pre request uh, you can keep it the room dark okay you have to keep the room dark but here as i am taking a video i cannot keep my room dark so you have to switch off all the lights for your better viewing uh, you have to tell the customer to look at a 660 target okay and you need your obviously your retinoscope okay so first starting with your retinoscope you have to see your movement vertically and horizontally okay you have to keep your one arm distance between the customer and your retinoscope ma'am please look at the mirror now i'm going to start with the working distance in place always remember you have to keep both the eyes open okay you cannot keep one eye closed when you are doing your retinoscopy ma'am please keep looking in the mirror okay so here we will see the horizontal movement and the vertical movement now for the horizontal movement i am not getting yes for the horizontal movement i am getting a against movement and for the vertical movement i am not getting any movement so here we will see the vertical movement and the horizontal movement okay and here i am getting your axis you can see a small line in your retinoscope the details have been discussed in your lecture okay so i see a small where i think approximately the axis is around 140 okay so uh, i am not getting any movement in the vertical so she is a plano cylinder and i'm going to start with uh, minus 0.25 okay okay uh no it's not yet neutralized so i'm going to keep proceeding with 0.25 uh this and it's going to check still it's not neutralized Still, it is not neutralized. Yeah. Okay. So here I am getting a no movement or a neutral movement. So it is minus one point two five at one forty degrees. I am just going a little ahead to check whether that is the neutral point or is this the neutral point. Okay. So here also I am seeing no movement again. so you can take minus 1.5 also now i am going to minus 1.75 yeah so here i am getting a with movement that means i have over corrected okay so i stop at minus 1.5 at 140 degrees okay so this is the retinoscopy value for my right eye the same procedure i am going to do for the left eye okay now whenever you are doing retinoscopy you have to remember that you use the same eye when you are using the right you use the right when you are using the left you use the left eye now uh, the only criteria is why you are doing this to avoid the parallax error okay if you are not comfortable then you can use the same eye okay you can close the other eye and continue with the same eye as i cannot close my right eye okay and i cannot just see with my left eye so i am using my right eye but if you are comfortable with using the either you can do the right to right and left to left okay again i am seeing the vertical and the horizontal movement okay here also i am getting an axis which i am adjusting and seeing okay it is both the movements are against okay So first, what are the axes? Approximately, it is. I think so. It is forty to fifty. Okay, it is forty to fifty. Okay, just let me see the 
for the spherical i start with minus 0.25 again okay yes it is 40 it is 45 to be more specific okay so it is 45 degrees which i've got here okay my still my vertical movement is not neutralized so i'm going to the next okay uh, here i'm getting no movement so i will just go a 0.25 ahead just to check whether it is right or no yeah so here i am getting a width movement so my end point for the spherical was minus 0 0.5 okay and now i am going to go with my cylinder okay so again i am starting here with minus 0 0.5 now okay you can start with minus 0 0.25 and go slowly slowly ahead just to save time i am doing that okay it is not neutral as yet and now I'm jumping in 0.5 uh, this. Okay, it is still not neutral. Yeah, okay, it's become neutral now. Okay, so I will just go again a 0.25 more to check for my with movement. No, it's still no movement it's showing. Yeah, okay, so this is with the width movement. Okay, so my end point is here. Okay. So in the left type, I've got minus 0 0.5 with minus 1.5 at 45 degrees Celsius. Okay, and in the right, I had got minus 1.25 at 140. Okay, so I leave my retinoscopy values in here to proceed for my subjective refraction.